please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance, followed by a moment of silence. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Coming up, find out exactly what all the hype was about during first lunch yesterday. And find out more about a club here on campus, today on FST News. Good morning. Today is Tuesday, May 17th. I'm Nikki Tabit. And I'm Summer Reyes. It may be the end of the year, but for all the students returning, it's never too late to start thinking of clubs to join next year. Bible Club is a club at Foothill that's open to anyone at school who wants to learn about the Bible. I talked with freshman and Bible Club member Mia, who told us about her experience in the club. It's taught me more about the Bible and some things I didn't even know. Mia also told us a little about the club and why she joined it. Well, I'm a Christian to start out with, and since we don't have any type of Christian classes to take, I decided to join Bible Club. I'd say if you're not a Christian, even if you are, you should join because you can learn a lot. Bible Club is ran by Maureen McIntyre in room 306, and if you want to learn about the Bible, this is a club for you. For Jet Alvarez, I'm Amanda Leek, FST News. You can always stop by room 306 and ask any questions you may still have. Two Foothill classes got some free pizza after winning the Mammoth Pony Push, Penny Push back in April, but the fun didn't end when the drive did. Yesterday, when the bell rang and dismissed students to first lunch, Foothill's band and varsity cheer team were already set up outside the gym performing Foothill's fight song. The students gathered, and the protector of Tool Springs, Sherry Gother, took the stage with tr trustee Deanna Wright, Principal Lisa Burkhead, Superintendent John Purdy, along with President of the Protectors of Tool Springs, Jill Despiano, and Board of Directors member, Stan Biederman. Each of them took some time to speak about the importance of preserving fossils and getting involved with your community. But when we face the challenge of trying to build a brand new park out of an area that had been used and abused, we decided to turn to the kids because it really does take a village and we knew that if we engaged you and asked you to become part of something bigger, you would rise to the occasion. The Mammoth Penny Push ultimately raised $33,748.54. The money will support the park and Foothill will have raised the most money out of all the high schools in the district to keep the trophy. Coming up after the break, find out what sports team broke eight different school records. Morning, Gary. We are GetSchooled.com. You want a college education, don't you? You know you do. That's why we're here. We're free and here to guide you through every step of the way, starting with attendance. <laughs> Gary, financial aid forms. Picking a college, man. You and us we go together like tacos and Tuesday. And I love tacos. Go to GetSchooled.com. This year's 2015 to 2016 swim team made a lot of history. The boys team placed second out of 14 teams in the region and girls placed at third. Eight foothill records were broken during swim regionals, a girls 200 relay, a boys 200 medley relay, 200 free and 100 fly by Denver Renner, 200 IM and 500 free by Caden Jesperson, a 200 boys free relay, a boys 400 free relay, and all these people plus Jacob Buckley and Wyatt Burnett are going to state to represent Foothill. So wish them luck and Victoria Bogdan going to state for diving. Before we go, just a reminder for any seniors that tomorrow is Odd Future Carnival, otherwise known as Hip Hop Day. 
And on Friday this week, there are a lot of other senior activities, but for juniors, sophomores, and freshmen, you guys have a regular school schedule. Well, for our last show ever together, that's all the news we have for you today. Actually, as a little thank you for being my co-anchor for the last two years and this year for being my best friend, just I a love little thank you. you. <laughs>